Okay guys, I'm not sure how stable this is. I have to record with my right hand because my finger's broken and I can't record with my other hand, so I'm not sure how stable this is. I actually am recording this with my regular hand, but yeah. Um not sure how I'm gonna do this. I can record it like that. Alright, yeah, I got it. Um at Fancy Basketball Week 5 recap is here. Those are the things that happened this week. I lost 5-4. Um, those are the standings. I am not doing my regular doing. Not doing that great. Not doing that great. Um, is there projections? No, no projections. I'm in fourth place. Yes. Uh, week six is on. It just started. We're going to go over my team. That is my team for the day. A lot of injuries. I made a claim to add Malik Beasley, so he'll fit into that spot right there. Um, yeah, yeah. Let's go through, set the team. That is set for the day. Actually, I think I did set it. Let's go over it. Let's just make sure I set it. I think I actually did set my team earlier today because I was bored. Um, I was bored, and I just set my entire team, I think. Uh, Saturday, full team. A couple guys are out, though. And no one going that day because it's NBA in season tournament. We just streamed. I just streamed for about a half hour. Um, so, yeah. Okay. Anyways, uh, we're back on to Monday. Uh, we're going to go through this week's matchup and next week. So, we're obviously going to win in threes. That's what we do every week. I don't think we've ever lost in threes. Uh, points is usually good. Assists and rebounds are usually... Or, rebounds is bad. Assists is usually good. Um, hopefully, Zion doesn't play well. This guy has just... Like, it, he has a lot of names on his team that you recognize. Like, Trey Young, James Harden, Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, Zion Williamson, Zach Levine, uh, WCJ, Wendell Carter Jr. Nobody's ever said that. He's injured. Horford, Rozier, Porter, Wiggins, Hart, Eason, uh, Terry Eason. So it's like, it's a lot of names that you know, but it's not that great of a team. <laughs> not that great of a team. Uh, last place, 11th, or no, not not last place. Okay, week five review. Uh, oh, we lost in threes. Look at that. We lost in threes made. Um, we did well in field goal percentage. Uh, we usually do well in that. Free throws, we're usually good in that. Threes, I can't believe we lost that. Points, we won. Rebounds, we won. Assists, we lost. Usually, we do well in assists. Steals, usually, we don't do great. And blocks, I don't think we're ever going to win in the blocks category. But we made it close. And turnovers, that kind of did kill us. But it was close. It was close. We could have won. It would suck if we lost by one. Um, those were the player stats for the week. Um, what else? There's not much to go over. It's only been like a two-and-a-half-minute video. Um... Yeah, and then we got this week going. We already set the lineup. Um, I want players who shoot a high percentage, um, a high percent field goal percentage, like Beasley, like Denny Ovdia. I could eye Denny Ovdia for sure. Um, definitely check out Denny Ovdia. I did pick him up for a little, and then I had to drop him though. Um, that was unfortunate. I didn't want to drop him. Um, how do you find his stupid forecast or whatever? How do you find his four? Oh, it's right there. Oh, it goes on to it. That's so weird. That is so weird. Okay, so, um, does he shoot a good field goal percentage? Oh, he shoots kind of good, actually. Look at that. Look at that field goal. So, I mean, 66. Is my camera blurry? I guess it is. It's not focusing on the right spot. Oh, my. There you go. That's better. Okay, 66, 37, 16, 55, 60, 63, 83. Um, 57, 33, and 55. Guys, I'll be straight with you. He is so inconsistent. Like, he shot 83% one game, and then literally another game he shot 16. That's so inconsistent. He shot 5 for 6 and then 1 for 6, but I'm okay with it. I don't want guys that are inconsistent. He does a little bit of everything. It'd be kind of nice to have him, I guess. I'm not fully sure if I want him. I could pick him up, though. Uh, ooh, Patrick Baldwin. I forgot Warriors traded him this summer. Um, yeah, that will be my number one guy off the waiver wire. Let's check out the league. That is the league for this week. Uh, we need the fifth place team to lose because he's right on my tail. He's like a game and a half behind me. We need him to lose. And he is, what, is he winning? Yeah, I think. Okay, not that, yeah. Um, I don't think there's that much more to go over. Um, I pretty much did it. Fancy football review coming tomorrow. We do have the Browns, or no, not the Browns, the Bears and the Vikings going on right now, 7 o'clock. But that's it, and peace.